in order to think about the lesson now, the, the openness, I'll combine it with one more story, and then I have my first challenge for you, how to combine that lesson about openness with this story about software patents. So uh, you see a picture of, of me dressed as if I were a Bavarian, uh, uh, shaking hands with somebody called Florian Müller. Florian Müller is a Bavarian, uh, and he was the person that saved Europe in 2005 from a plague called software patents. So he designed a campaign with some support from MySQL uh, called No Software Pat Patents. The idea then was to harmonize legislation all over Europe so that software patents would be, patents would be allowed in all European countries. And isn't software patents such a good thing because it protects the inventor and it promotes creativity and it's for the good of humanity and everybody that the intellectual property that everybody creates is protected from being taken over by somebody else. Well, that's how the incumbent players portrayed it. The incumbent players, the big boys, they, they are the ones that have an interest in protecting their market share. And I think that these days, the number of people who understand that software patents are truly evil and they hamper innovation. They make it impossible to innovate and there's no value for, uh, uh, except for perhaps career development in an individual owning a software patent. It doesn't protect him in any way uh, against uh, an incumbent player that wishes to take over uh, his, his, his product. Now, in 2005, it was almost clear that the incumbent players would win and software patents, which are in the interest only of big software players, mostly from the US, would be allowed uh, on a legal basis in Europe. Uh, against all odds, Florian was at that point uh, arguing with all political parties in the European Parliament and the end outcome was not allowing them. Uh, other things have happened and you can these days associate Florian's name uh, with with other uh, um, fights in the IT industry where his, his position on, on openness is not entirely the same. But the point here of this story is not just that software patents are evil from the point of view of humanity or, or individuals or, or small players, but it is that incumbents, while they are strong, they can be won. So you can change Europe. You can have an impact. It, it, I have seen it for myself that working with those who have more power than, than uh, I would have imagined that anybody would have in, uh, when I was the median age of, of, of this audience, that it is possible to win. And now comes my first challenge to you. And it's